Is that how you even know that you're the kids? Can you feel the beat? Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, like the doctor that I had, he's like, uh, the only way I know where the beat is is I see people's hands clapping, so I just clap when they clap. <laughs> Gentlemen, welcome to the 1905. How are you? But how about the rest of you? How are you? Hey, I know it's one of those those weird Portland What's days uh, where it's kind of gray and rainy. I know they're common, but uh, thank you for being here. Uh, please give it up to the Mount Hood Community College Jazz Combo that performed earlier this evening. 
It brings me a great deal of pleasure to introduce tonight's band. Uh, give it up for our drummer tonight, Mr. Tim Rapp. Yeah. On the bass, the incredible Tim Gilson. Yeah. On the keys, the man who made tonight happen. Give it up for Dan Davey. Yeah. And our new friend, the extraordinary woodwind player, uh, director of jazz at West Virginia University. Please give it up. He plays all over the East Coast, uh, Pittsburgh, Boston, New York. He also, like most musicians, has not played on all seven continents. So that is not notable, but I thought I'd point it out. Uh, have you? Okay. Uh, I don't, can you, if you were to play saxophone on Antarctica, would you ever be able to disconnect? That's what I wonder. Um, aren't you glad you know what, what I wonder? I think your, your lives are now better. Uh, please give it up for Jared Sims.
Thanks, everybody. That's a uh, new tune off a very upcoming release. Very brand new thing that I just did in the studio. It was an amazing day with, uh, with a great bass player named Rufus Reed and a drummer named Matt Wilson, my East Coast friends. Uh, but it's a pleasure to be here with West Coast friends playing all this music. This next one's uh, a tune, tune called Wetlands Preserve from a record called The New York Sessions. So I, this next tune is off of New York record. Wetlands, Wetlands is a club that was in New York. It was a great rock club. And so this is jazz music, but I played a lot of rock music. And so this is from this rock club called The Wetlands. I used to hang out there with my wife, who's quietly sitting in the corner right now. Give it up for Amy. So this is called Wetlands Preserved.
Rap Rap on the drum. Pleasure to be here. It's a pleasure to meet new friends, see some old ones. The student band from Mount Hood, you guys were great. Awesome to hear. So uh, this is all around a good time. Thanks for joining us. We're gonna we're gonna play an, another one. My my new city's Pittsburgh, and so this one this one's very Pittsburgh. It's a tune called Quick Quick Hit. Pittsburgh's got all these great legends from there, and the list just keeps going. And it starts with like Art Blakey and Stanley Tarantino, uh, Roy Eldridge, Errol Garner. Like on, on each instrument there's legends and everything's got this greasy backbeat groove. So when I went to Boston where I met Dan Davey, I was like, where's the groove? There's no, there's no grit. Everything, everything's kind of, <laughs> well it grooves, but you know. There's no grease, there's no blues, so we're trying to get the blues, and so that's what this tune's about.
This, this next piece is inspired by somebody that inspired me, and that's Gary Simoleon. He's a killer Barry Sachs player, and I've got to hang with him a few times. And so this is, this is a form that we talked about. This is an original tune that I wrote called Diesel. You guys know Gary Simoleon? Yeah. He's a Barry player in the, in the, in the uh, Monday Night Village Vanguard Band, which is basically the Thad Jones big band. The guy's amazing. I went down there on Monday night. He had, a, had the whole book memorized. Pretty impressive. But he's, a, he's also a really nice guy and a great man. So this, this tune came from that called The Diesel.
yeah, this is a wonderful band. I appreciate having the opportunity to play with these guys on the drums. Tim Rapp, give it up. Tim Gilson on the bass. The man responsible for this mess tonight is Dan Davies on the piano. Give it up for Dan. We're gonna we're gonna do a piece that's on my last record called the New York Sessions. This is called the Bodega, and uh, you know it might be it might be easy to hear. This is actually. This is based yeah. off of Cherokee. This is a really, really standard piece of music called Cherokee. So if you know Cherokee, this might sound just a, like 5% like Cherokee. It's a rework. <laughs> Hope you enjoy it. Thank you, thank you all for being here.
hope you guys don't mind the jazz flute. It, it kind of makes me giggle a little bit too, but it's kind of a nice change of pace. <laughs> don't worry, I won't jump on any tables or go in the bathroom or anything. We'll keep it. We'll, we'll keep it. We'll keep it straight. <laughs> It's totally possible to smile and play the saxophone, but smiling and playing the flute doesn't work at all. So, let's get serious.
Thank you all. We're gonna we're gonna keep playing some music. We're gonna go on to uh, another brand new composition. It's a piece called Winter. It's got a little fire, I think. Hope you enjoy. It.
Yeah, we'll do one on the way actually. Someone else need it? Oh, we've all got it. We're going to do a tune called Bon Voyage. This is off a trio record. It doesn't have piano, but it's so much more hip with piano. So, so uh, Dan's going to be the star of the show on this one. Uh, bon Voyage.
This is another brand new tune that I wrote for a recording session that I did with Rufus Reed, who's a fantastic bass player. It was a very uh, inspiring couple of days that I got to spend with him. And so this is a bit of an homage to the great Wayne Shorter, the wonderful tenor saxophone player from Weather Report and Miles Davis bands. So this is uh, my Homage to Wayne Shorter, 2.5.
Lady on the piano. Give it up to Tim Rapp on the drums. Tim Gilson on the bass. My name is Jared Tim. This is a called 245. Thank you all for being here. Suave.
the bass from the bass. Davey on the piano. It's a pleasure to be here at the 1905. This place is awesome. I hope you were here to see my friend Emily the other night. My friend Emily is a great singer I know from New York and Boston. She's a killer singer. But unfortunately that happened a few nights ago. So if you weren't here you missed it. I'm sorry I missed it. She's awesome. So this is a, this is a cool spot. Thank you for having us. We're going to take a short break after this. We're going to play some more music, so please stick around.